Good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas. Day eh, 45. I I look disheveled. It's just because my makeup's not on and my hair's up. Um, I'm on my way to a doctor's appointment. There's absolutely nothing wrong with me. I don't want to keep it that way. In my entire adult life, I've never had a primary care physician. And in America, in the United States of America, that means just it's like one doctor who knows all your baseline stuff and you go to them for everything. I've been able to have one, I just never have. And I'm like, I'm 31, I should have a baseline doctor. Like one that just knows all the things and they're the, and they're the ones that refer you to specialists. Like if there's something wrong with your stomach or a dermatologist or stuff like that. That car can go. You can go, sir. Sir, you have a green arrow. You should, oh, now that it's yellow, you wanna go? Oh, and then you stopped. You were on your phone. You missed an entire light because you were just sitting there on your phone. Anyway. um. So I'm going today. I have some moles on my head that I want checked out. So I want to be referred to a dermatologist. I have a hemorrhoid I want to get rid of. And I just, you know, want a baseline. I know I'm healthy right now, so I want them to make sure that this is what I stay at. So I'm gonna go do a doctor's appointment and let them examine me. Woohoo. Dude, they just measured me one thing. They're not making me sit on that. I'm sitting on a normal chair. But also they just measure me. I grew a quarter of an inch. <laughs> I'm five foot ten and a quarter. I'm unstoppable. We love a growing queen. I'm growing spiritually, emotionally, and physically. Height wise, not even muscle wise, height wise. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with this. Oh. Every time a guy says he's 5'10 and I'm taller than him, I'm like, you're lying. Maybe they weren't lying. Maybe they were 5'10 because I'm 5'10 and a quarter. What up? <laughs> I was, so apparently that was just a meet and greet with a doctor. And then I scheduled a full women's wellness exam for March. And then they gave me a name for a dermatologist to get moles. You wanna see some gross moles? I have this, I don't know if you can see it. I have a mole back here that's I think getting bigger. And then I have a mole back here that seems to be the same, but then I have a mole here that keeps bugging me. And then I have this like growth thing on my shoulder. That, uh, it's been removed twice and it keeps growing back. I want that taken care of. And then I got a name for a, a surgeon because I have a hemorrhoid I need removed. So, hey, what's up? I am the example of health. Why does my thing keep tapping? And speaking of, I don't know what to do because I already showered because I thought they were gonna wellness exam this today. They did not, um, but I need to work out. It's 8.30, so I'm just gonna act like I do every morning because this is usually when I wake up. So I'm gonna have my coffee and edit my vlog. Hey. I've been working. We've filmed the a Rachel Uncensored. Lots of people said eggnog. Yeah, no, I, I, that's a little weird. I, you I like eggnog? No, I'm gonna say, I said eggnog's a little weird. Oh. Like it's not a thirst quenching thing. It's just like a lot of sugar. I just, it was holiday horror That's stories edition. How dare you make noise while I'm editing? My fingers left. Hello? <laughs> Our standing desk has somehow gotten so lazy. <laughs> We're now on the couch while using it. It's because my walking treadmill is missing. You would never use it. Imagine trying to precisely cut a clip while walking. Yeah, like this. No, precisely where it... Yeah, watch this. Oh, that's precise. Your finger <laughs> slipped while you were sitting. <laughs> Why do you have to call me on my bed? <laughs> anyway, uh, I did a bunch of cameos just now. It is holiday season. It's a good Christmas present. I was, I've tried to make each one longer than three minutes. It's very, I was very impressed by my part. A lot of ADHD brain going on there. Um, but ugh, what candy? It's a ring pop. I have that one to work on next. We got this for a video and ended up not using it because Emily was deathly ill and couldn't eat a pound of sugar. <laughs> but we got this giant ring pop and uh. Wait, put it next to your head for comparison. I have an average head. Do you? <laughs> my ego is huge. My physical head is actually very average. But yeah, that thing's huge. Anyway, I came in here to find a TikTok and to see if Emily, Emily's been trying to redo the cork wall. The pens mean she's redone them. The missing ones, we obviously have not been done. <laughs> they fell off. <laughs> they fell. She's trying to, should we have fan of the week? When it's all done, we just post a picture of the fan. Yeah. The fan of the week. I'm trying to think of something fun we could do with the cork wall. That could work. Okay, we will have one square will be Emily's compliment of the day. No. I am. Yeah. Are you and, writing it about yourself? Well, you would write it. And then, and then we would do fan of the week, and then on another square we would do 
I wasn't trying to fill every square. Well. <laughs> I was just, I was actually trying to make it like, you're the only thing up there is that you're the fan of the week. Oh. Well, can, I, can there be an employee of the month square? It's just a different dog every week. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the UPS driver. It's driver. me. I pick me. The postman. <laughs> Piss box. So Zara texted us a couple days ago and said, we obviously need to make Christmas cookies and then we can just give them away to people. I said, okay. So Zara just came over and we're apparently gonna make Christmas cookies. Some vegan, some not. And the plan is to just give them to people. Let's go. some sushi that we ordered. Wow. All right, guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I very much did. I'm exhausted. You'll see why in the next vlog, but um, our sushi was delicious. Our cookies were amazing. We all ate like one, and then this morning we actually took them to homeless people. You'll see that in the next vlog. It was a lot of fun. Zara likes to do little cute things like that. Apparently she hasn't done any Christmas. This is dirty. I apologize. I don't know where my camera is. I didn't want to go find it. But, oh, it's literally right there. I'm looking at it. Well, you get what you get. What do you expect? Shouldn't expect more from me. Accept me for who I am, please. Anyway, uh, Zara apparently hasn't done anything Christmassy and she really wanted to do something Christmassy and we're the Christmas couple. So she came on over with Clayton and um, we had a lot of fun. That's it, I love you guys. Next week is as normal. And then I am taking a couple weeks off my podcast, but next week is normal stuff. So check it out if you want. I love you and I'll see you tomorrow for another vlog.